Okay, uh, what I wanted to do was uh, generate, uh, show you how to generate the uh, Pittsburgh Steelers uh, logo. Okay, it's Pittsburgh Steelers logo is a, is a, a hypocycloid. And uh, let me correct this. That's not written correctly. It's a uh, text hypo. Hypo cycloid. Okay. Hypocycloid. And uh, a hypocycloid is uh, the Pittsburgh Steelers logo. Here's the equations I use to generate that, this, these logos. These equations are easily derivable, high school math, okay? Maybe I'll do another video and show you. It's, I think it's three pages, you know, to derive that. Okay, here's the, here's the Pittsburgh Steelers logo. You'll see each one of these is a hypocycloid, okay? So there's four of them in each emblem. So one, four, eight, three times four is 12. Uh, one, two, three, four, three times four is 12. Okay, and uh, this this logo really belongs to the Steel Corporation. And what the Steelers did, they just added ERS to it and uh, they call it Steelers, but it's the Steel Corporation's logo. They didn't change anything on it. Okay, here it is. This is how it goes. I only left one circle in here. There's a circle here and a circle here. And uh, there's three circles generating here, but I left one of these circles in to show you that there's a circle to generate this. I didn't want to crowd it with three circles, you know. So, that's it. And I colored them, tried to get them gold, red, and blue, you know. I just don't have them filled in. But that's the Steelers, com the Steelers logo. The Steelers logo is on the right side of their helmet. And uh, the Steelers logo is a hypocycloid, a mathematical equation. Okay, that's it.